and I'm uh, supporting them all around the world. And this gap was for me the chance to build up my business. What's the bigger challenge, your parents' point of view or German authorities? What makes a startup successful? If you want to know about that, this is the right place. Welcome to today's founder stories with X Group and Dominik Wolaschka. Hi Dominik, welcome to today's session. How are you today and who are you? I'm fine, thank you Markus. And um, my name is Dominik Wolaschka. I'm coming near Frankfurt Main. It's the Rhein-Main area and my home place is Limburg Lahn and um, I'm expert for consulting quality management systems. What exactly do you do for customers? Um, I'm expert for the automotive sector. I'm supporting customers to build up a quality management system according to the IITF 16949 or ISO standards or to optimize their quality management system or to audit their quality management system. Sounds a bit complicated. Who are your customers? My customers are working for the OEMs. They are producing parts for the uh, cars and it's uh, the tier one or tier X uh, producing parts for a car. And I'm uh, supporting them all around the world to implement or to, to optimize, stabilize their management systems. That sounds really fascinating. We're living in quite challenging times. What motivated you to get self-employed and found a startup in times like these? Yes, if, if the uh, times are very tough, it's a good uh, option to start a business from my point of view. So I say there was build a gap of the Corona pandemic in the last two years. And this gap was for me the chance to build up my business to, um, to close the gap in the companies what, what builds in the last two years in their management systems. And this is why I start to grow my business in these times. What were the major challenges you had to face before you started? The major challenge was uh, what is the, the minimum finance structure I need. So I'm very uh, uh, grow up uh, with a lot of uh, um, focus to have enough money to live by your own, not uh, supporting from externals. And um, that's the first step what I'm struggling with. So is my business good enough to, to earn money to stabilize my daily life, my daily uh, living or monthly payments? And the second point was to struggle with the German rules and requirements. So it's a very difficult uh, structure in Germany and uh, you need to know where to go and what formulas you need to fill out to get the right uh, information from the government. What's the bigger challenge, your parents' point of view or German authorities? Uh, the German authorities are the biggest point because if, you, uh, if your business is good and you are willing to do business, then it's everywhere a possibility to earn money. But to struggle with the government's requirements, you have no chance. You need to follow them. From today's perspective, how do you see the challenges? from this point of view? Yeah, from today point of view, and I'm more than uh, four months uh, in my business, building up my business. And um, it was very good to, to have a partner from the first day on, to have a minimum uh, uh, um, basic where I can earn money with. And um, the second point is that um, to fill up the business plan and financial structure. So this is the big challenge. And this is why I'm very happy to have uh, X Group as a partner on my side to build up this uh, business plan, financial plans uh, with the, with the um, knowledge and the experience of the X Group. You worked with a couple of different consultants and coaches. How was the concept of doing this with a variety of people? The concept to have uh, one major contact or one major coach, uh, I like it very much because uh, you speak very open in these coaching sessions 
and it's uh, needed that you have a good uh, uh, level of understanding to the coach that he knows what is your thinking that he can support you as much as possible to ramp up your business plan to uh, uh, stabilize or to finalize your finance plan and uh, what was very helpful you we talk about the government's reg regulations and so on that we have uh, the possibility to go in contact with experts for requirements or for marketing uh, questions that these experts can step in with the help and the leading of the, the lead coach or the major coach I am in contact with. So it seems that you like the concept of working with different specialists on the different topics. Yeah, I like the concept to have one major contact and the possibility to use the network. This is what I like. Yeah, That's great. How did you find X Group and decide to work with X Group? I was in discussion or communication with a uh, founder. He's working also with the X Group together. And he said, hey, if you have the idea to build up your own business, there's a company in Berlin. Let's have a look to the internet side. You can have a first uh, telephone call uh, to understand and to, to uh, ask what is the concept of the X Group and how they can support you. And this is where I come in contact with the X group. So a founder working with the X group before, uh, tell me this is a good company you can uh, ask for support. And with the internet platforms, with the videos, with the instructions, and the first call with the expert of the X group is, was my decision to, to use the X group and the experience of the X group. It was a recommendation that led you to us. Would you also recommend X group? Yes, I recommend to other founders. So if you have the idea and you have the courage to do it, then use a partner because I'm working around four or five years with my own in my own circle. And it helps if you have a big partner with a lot of uh, founding companies and a lot of experience in the background. You're working now for four months self-employed you said building up your business now for four months what were the major successes you realized at that time the major success successes was that uh, the step in i get with my old company as a partner so this was the minimum to start it was very helpful to had the first business before founding my business and after the the t first two months where i'm building or in in where I'm uh, starting to build my business plan and my fun financial plans. Other companies I'm working with in the last five years contact me and say, hey, let's do business together. We hear that you grow your own business. You are good in the past working for us. Please uh, get in contact to, to have a partnership together. And so after two months, I have three possibilities to work with my old companies as a partner. And this is a very uh, um, helpful base to grow the business if you have partners because if you start and nobody knows you as an own company it helps if you have bigger partners in in your network to get more visibility in the network where you are and what are you doing what were the three biggest learnings you took out of the coaching what are the three biggest learnings you took out of the coaching the three biggest learnings are that with the uh, knowledge of the coach I'm working together with um, helps me to get focused on other products and businesses uh, I can work with and I can grow up my business with. The second one is um, that you need to work very focused on the business plan. But if you are too struggling, what is the right thing to put in the business plan? What is the right uh, structure of the finance plan? It helps to make a break for one or two days because it's a uh, very uh, visual or vision thinking and you need a break. If it's too much and you are struggling with yourself, make a break and start again after one or two days. And the third point is um, you need uh, to look in the internet and do um, screening what can be helpful for your business plan. But you need to find a point where to finish it because the internet is so big. And if you want to uh, find out all, the time is too short and you are searching in the internet more than you need because 
the focus can, can be get loosed. Great learnings. Thank you for sharing this with us. Do you have three tips for founders that want to start now? My three tips for founders is if you are sure and you are willing and burning inside to do your business, do it. Because after doing it, starting it, it goes on. If you think too long about it, it will never happen and you are uh, stopped in thinking about it. The second point is use partners like the X group to support you and to, to uh, uh, handle your structure and support you to structure your business. And the third point is um, get in communication with network of your own network, network of your um, friends and the network of the X group and other networks you can work together with. So starting working with specialists and doing a lot of networking. Networking and communication, correct. If our customers want to reach you, how do they find you? You can find me on the internet. It's the um, www.volashka.net or you can uh, get in contact directly with me, uh, dominic at volashka.net. And also I'm on social media on Sing and LinkedIn. There you can see where I'm coming from and how I can support you. Thank you very much for being here. Dear founders, if you like this video, press the like button and subscribe to the channels to get more videos like this. If you have questions for your startup, ask them in the comment field below. You also find the contact details of Dominic. Thanks for being with us and see you soon.